Hey, ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen, ladies, we are in Huntington Beach today, actually Huntington Harbor, yep. at Bill Texas Barbecue, mm. established in 2020, right before the pandemic, but it's been worth the wait. You know, Hammer, there's uh, two of my favorites, right? I love barbecue and I love Mexican food. There are a lot of options in Orange County for Mexican food. There are not a lot of options for good barbecue. You know, there's always that argument about Texas barbecue, mm -hmm. you know, chili with beans, chili without gotta beans. Gotta have beans. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta have beans, right? Yeah. But Texas barbecue is mostly about beef, you know, brisket, they, that slow, you know, that's a tough piece of meat, but when you slow cook it under, you know, a smoke light flame, it. smoke yep. that thing yep. for a number of hours, it's the most tender and it's right here in front of us, guys. We're going to taste it here in a minute. You know, pretty much you see a lot of vegetarian options here. There's a table for vegetarians over there. You see how vacant that is? Yeah, there's nobody's nobody there. here for that. <laughs> <laughs> but Bill's uh, Texas barbecue, I mean, guys, everything that you could possibly want from Texas, if you were sitting at a smokehouse and you got cattle running by you, <laughs> this is where you're at, yeah. except you're on a beautiful harbor. And owner Brett Beal, right, he grew up in Santa Ana. Yep. Uh, he followed his grandmother, but more importantly, his mother yep. with her cooking. You know, Five years old, yep. sitting at the stove, getting up there with his brother. Mm -hmm. And, you know, the two of them are you know, just love the cooking environment. And they've done some professional cooking, uh, some uh, uh, contests, you know, that kind of the championship barbecue stuff. And it's absolutely a place you're gonna wanna come in Huntington Beach. So when you come down to the coast this summer, or even now if you can make it, um, this is a place, Bill's Texas Barbecue, it's right on the harbor. You got boats right in front of you. But the most important thing is, and I'm about ready oh, to slam into it, nice. is this fabulous. Most people don't know, Texas barbecue is something that they've always done over smoking, but there's a lot of love that goes into it because it takes a lot of time and energy. And recipes, right? The dry right. rubs, the special recipes. He's not gonna tell you what's in these things because no. that's a family recipe from way back. But they put all the, you know, the, the garlics and the sure. spices and the yeah. cumin and all that. But here's the thing. Um, if you love spicy, if you love exotic flavor um, with an old fashioned. Ah, an old cheers fashioned, to that. cheers to that, yeah. I'll be right with you. Mm. But what I'm missing, and I, and I wish these cameras would do this, but they don't, you can't smell. We need smell-o-vision. We need smell-o-vision. Oh, That's man. Right. Wouldn't that be cool? <laughs> yeah, it would we be. We smell-o-vision? This is just fabulous. Just Bill's mm. Texas Barbecue Smell-o-vision. <laughs> by would, the way. It would sell out every day. Yeah, and give you a, a, even a better idea. A lot of you folks, when you talk about Huntington Beach, Huntington Beach is huge, but this is Sunset Beach part of, if you guys remember where, uh, the old, remember the old Red Onion, remember that used to be? Yeah. That's exactly where this is. Uh, Peter's Landing? Peter's, Peter's Landing. Peter's Landing, right? Yeah. And like you said, there's three garage doors in front of us on the other side of the cameras right here that are all glass, that all open up right to the boats in the harbor. And while you're here, look at the, what you get to eat. And you know what? It's a great place to bring the family, you know, so they can experience this kind of cuisine. That's the only other place you're gonna get this, even though he's from Santa Ana. <laughs> he's well trained and I'm in Texas right now, I'm in Austin right now, sitting at one of the beautiful places there, so. You know, and Hammer, another really interesting thing about this is it's a black-owned business, and there are not a lot of those in Orange County either. No. This, these guys know exactly what they're doing with this barbecue, and it is, I, let's, we gotta have some of this. Let's do how it, how let's jump into it. Yeah, I'm gonna have a little bit of this. Yeah. What do you have in there? Uh, you know, first I thought, you know, Beale, I have a last name Beale, maybe it's from New Orleans, right? Yeah. Beale Street, and all yeah. that kind of stuff. But well, no. well, they, you know, they, his history is, they are from Louisiana. I mean, their, their family is from there. So, but he grew up in Santa Ana. It's not where you grow up. It's who taught you, yeah. right? And his mom taught him how to, you know, they were very passionate about this food. And the thing about food today that I don't like is that you go to these restaurants and these big corporate guys, they have no passion. You know, it's not a, it's a, it's some recipe and you got this whatever cook. Well, it has to be replicatable, right? Yeah. It's like a McDonald's. It has to have the exact same thing, whether you're in, in uh, Japan or if you're in, in Huntington Beach, it's going to be the exact same. That's not what you're going to get here. This is specific. It's, it's, you know, 
It's different every time they bring it out, but it's still the same family recipes. So I'm going for the mac and cheese first. Mac and Bill's cheese. Texas barbecue. You know that's yeah. really important. Yeah, there's a, there's we got mm. ribs, we got pulled pork, we've got uh, sausage, brisket, is, brisket. Yeah, all slow cooked, all uh, smoked. I, I you know. And I the interesting thing about the pulled pork is that that's not a a big Texas barbecue thing, but a lot of people. That's true. You know yeah. um, that are from Mississippi and back that way. They like their their pork. You know, people in Texas like their beef. You will not be disappointed. And let me tell you guys something. The price point is perfect. It's a great place to bring the family. The kids get to see the boats. Maybe you can go out on a Duffy, do whatever, do whatever you want. But spend the day down here and have some amazing, and I did say it, <laughs> Texas barbecue. And they've got a lot of TVs throughout. You can watch sports here. There's a, this is a big you know, space. There's a lot of space here, big bar. And here's the other thing, guys. They do live music here. That's right. You know, they do different things on Sundays. They, you know, it, it's, it's a place where it's happening. You you're might not going to be bored. You might even run into the beautiful Morgan while she's bartending here as well. So, you know. If you're lucky enough, because Morgan is a beautiful girl. <laughs> she is. So, guys, we're going to enjoy our meal. Come down to Bill's Texas Barbecue in Huntington Beach. You are going to love the food.